Hey guys, welcome back. I know how painful it is to not to find the right course for something that you're trying to learn, right? So what I did was that I went through 25 different courses of full stack development and narrowed it down to top seven, which you must need to know, right? And the best part is that this list of seven, right, includes both free as well as the paid one. And they cover from basics to the advanced level of full stack development, which is used by the industries, right? And this list, they include the stacks of everything since it's a full stack of course you need to include everything from databases backend devops version management front end all this stuff all right so without wasting any time let's dive in starting off with the basics of web development fireship scores stand out here so it's very concise very engaging right and it's perfect for beginners it covers html css javascript it's very fun and very easy to follow Right, so you can go through the entire video. It's like 30 minutes or something. Okay, Fireship explains from the basics. This can be internet, DNS, how web works, and everything. And then comes to HTML, CSS, mix of JavaScript, and everything. Of course, if you wish, you can move forward, learn a bit more JavaScript if you want. But this is should this should be sufficient to get started. Right, let's move on. All right, next up, Node.js, the backend stuff. So here, two courses actually shine a lot. The first one is from Mosh Hamadani, the complete Node.js guide. And the next one is from Dr. Angela Yu, the web developer bootcamp. So you guys must be already familiar with the second one, right? Quite popular among every single web developer. But let me go over the first one, the Mosh Hamadani course. So here, one of the courses that I personally used to learn Node.js, to succeed in Node.js actually, the way Mosh actually covers everything is very thorough and very practical. Mosh goes through a lot of uh, concepts in Node.js, explaining everything in a very precise and very easy way that anybody can understand it. Okay, and Mosh also puts effort in creating projects as well for us. So it'll help you out uh, with projects creating, it can be APIs. So everything is hands-on learning. There's nothing like a theoretical learning. Everything is hands-on. The next thing is, of course, the Web Developer Bootcamp from Angela Yu. So very friendly and very comprehensive, okay? But the bootcamp consists of everything from beginning to advanced level, where Node.js is actually a part of it. So if you're only looking for Node.js, just you can just refer to that. But if you are looking for something for an entire course, full, full stack, like front-end, back-end database and everything, yeah, we can refer the same course as well. Okay, with that said, let's move on to the next one. Hold on. Before we move on, there's one exciting thing I wanna share with you guys. Okay, so, you know, when we wanna try to learn new things or build some amazing projects or to try something new or to find out what we want to do in tech there are a lot of questions in front of us right so we always get okay oh, there are so many options what to do uh, if i do this will i get will i get a good salary or if i do that will that be worth it in the future or if i want to build a project whatever projects to build what tech stack to choose so many questions right so we came up with this new initiative it's called one-to-one -one mentorship okay it's like a personalized guidance for you guys we understand your problem and we create a tailored roadmap for you or a tailored plan and this plan will be tailored according to your requirement, what you want to do and according to our discussions with, between us. Okay, one-to-one -one discussion, not from some online roadmap or something. Okay, this will help you to become a better developer, solve better problems. And if you're building, let's say you want to build some projects, you'll be able to build real projects with real data instead of some just to-do list or something like that. Okay, so if you're interested or if you think this is very interesting, consider signing up. Okay, it's for, first call is really free. So you can just jump on a call, see how it goes to get the experience of it. Okay, the link is in the description. Check it out. Okay, let's move on. All right, next up is React, the front end stuff. So here there are two courses again. One is the complete React developer course from Andri Negoji. And of course, the other one is from Dr. Angela Yu. <laughs> right, so one of the best thing about is that uh, Andri's course, right? Uh, it covers from the basic, when I say basic, from class components. So you might tell me, oh no, the class components is not required anymore. People use hooks, all functional component error and everything. Let me tell you, so when you learn class components, you will learn the lifecycle methods. You will actually see lifecycle methods in action when you're, when you're using class components. Uh, Andrew's course actually covers advanced React as well from ground up from the scratch, okay? And of course, Dr. Angela's course is pretty good. It covers uh, quite a good amount of uh, React content. Since it's a complete bootcamp, you might miss out, miss out something in that, okay? But I would personally recommend you guys to pick Andrew's course here because it's very in-depth, okay? Learning from the scratch, understanding from the basics on why React behaves that way and why is it really important, what is the purpose of React entirely, okay? So this is the very good uh, course in React. And of course, you can pick Dr. Angela Yu's course as well. Pretty popular, pretty good, pretty beginner friendly as well. Okay, nothing to argue in that, all right? 
let's move on all right next up is the git and github of course where is full stack without git and github and git and github is uh, very popular since it's very popular there are a lot of free courses i don't recommend you guys to pay for to pay to learn git and github actually i would recommend you guys to check out tutorials from like a fire shape uh, free code camp or from kunal as well okay uh, everything is linked in the description of course all the links are in the description they cover everything that you want to know what is the basic stuff like uh, committing staging uh, pushing it to the uh, like you know your remote repository creating branches creating pull request merging pull request and all this stuff and once you are familiar with these basic thing try to move one step forward try to learn cherry picking try to learn squashing commits and everything okay when you're working with a large team with a very huge code base like a mono report or something like that okay because they would like to squash commits when they are merging a pr because they don't want like a huge commit history okay so when you're working with small team those things doesn't really matter okay so consider learning these things this might take you like what 30 40 minutes to learn the basic and then once you're good with that just spend around 30 minutes of time to learn the advanced stuff okay let's move on to the next one thing is the docker and devops i mean it's entirely devops but the reason i'm saying docker is because if you don't want to do devops it's fine but just learn docker as well okay so two courses here stand out okay one is the docker i mean devops with docker from code cloud so code cloud is actually a platform completely if you are more into devops engineering i would say go to code cloud sign up with their subscription just learn the courses they have they have a learning tracks like if or if you just want docker uh, check out this devops with docker course okay that's in udemy it's for very uh, affordable price and the next one is docker and kubernetes by stefan grader okay stefan grader is the one guy that i actually admire a lot okay i've actually i've learned docker and kubernetes from his course the way he uh, covers the concepts is really really uh, amazing because he doesn't use some fancy tools or fancy animations to and uh, like you know explain everything all he does is will have some very basic uh, box box diagram okay he'll explain okay this uh, this happens here that happens here and this goes here that goes here that's all okay he'll make sure that you understand every single concepts from storage volumes to networking how things communicate how the data is shared everything okay so next up is the back end fundamentals so wait didn't we just look into node js since it, it isn't it for back end of course it is for back end but back end fundamentals here what i'm explaining is actually some of the add on concepts that you will have to implement okay because see when you're building projects you'll be solving multiple problems here right here in back end fundamentals the course i'm recommending is the fundamentals of back end engineering by hussein nasir this guy explains some of the protocols patterns and many other different things in back end engineering okay it can be web sockets it can be polling it can be long polling so many concepts okay so this will give you some exposure on solutions that you want to derive in back end engineering okay it covers a lot of protocols lot of patterns you will learn a lot of uh, different things that comes in the back end okay it will help you solve amazing problems in the future All right the next comes is the sql and postgres uh, if you are into more data science i would say go with this sql for data science by california university is from coursera you can apply for a financial aid if you are lucky you will get a free access for the course okay but if you're not into data science you just want to learn sql for projects right then i would say go with this uh, sql bootcamp from jose portilla okay so this guys is really good the course is very popular he explains every concepts very uh, like you know in a very experimental way okay and also of course there is another one course from stefan grader as well okay the legend okay stefan grader again explains everything in a very detailed way using the diagrams and everything very beginner friendly both these courses okay every both are available on udemy for very affordable price you can pick it up so these are the top 7 full stack engineering courses i recommend after reviewing all these 25 courses from different authors okay so each course has its unique perspective unique way of teaching their own plan okay and different purpose okay you have to understand this okay of course some people might disagree with me with this but of course as i said each course have a different purpose and different way of teaching try it out okay let us know if you have any issues you can of course join us on discord or whatsapp community give us a message saying that hey this is, you know, i'm doing this i have some doubt can you help me with that we'll be happy to help you out with that and remember if you need a personal guidance okay from me okay where i'll help you one to one to learn web development or to build a project or let's say to choose what you want to do in your tech career there's a link in the below sign up for a free call we'll get in a call talk about your problems we'll see what we can do regarding that okay and thank you so much for watching till the end okay and if you found this helpful consider leaving a like okay share it with your friends as well and of course drop a comment on which course do you think is really good and if you have tried any of this course and if there's any other recommendation for other community of course please to drop a link in the comment okay see you next time until then have a great day bye bye